All right, Coach Sam from Baseball Strength back with you. We've got, got a request from Coach Trav for some new agility drills and some ways to make indoor practice more lively. Uh, we're going to take care of both of those with this one little setup. What we've got is five hurdles set up, 18 inches, three feet, 18 inches, and three feet. That's the way it's set up. Five feet off to each side, we have a tennis ball on each side. It could be a tennis ball, it could be a baseball, uh, it could be whatever you need it to be. We're going to move through the first two hurdles, attack the ball. Get back in, move through the next two hurdles, and attack the ball again. There's a couple different ways we're going to do it. So Craig's going to demonstrate the first way. We're going to run straight through the first two, shuffle over, scoop the ball, shuffle back, up through the next two hurdles. Go ahead. And then we finish off with an acceleration sprint at the end. That's the easiest method to do. Easiest way, straight forward, shuffle out, shuffle back. If you want to get a little bit more creative, we're going to turn sideways. Now we're going to shuffle sideways through the hurdles, drive forward as if we we're field, a third baseman charging a bunt. Then we're going to backpedal through. On these two hurdles, we're going to have to get a crossover. So on these hurdles, I'm going to walk through it for you. We're going to step in, cross over and spin to attack the next ball. So there's a walkthrough. Craig's going to take us through at full speed. He's going to backpedal, cross over and spin, backpedal and accelerate out. So there we're working on forward motion, we're working on backpedals, we're working on sideways, and we're working on spinning. In a game of baseball, when you get spun around, you still need to be in control of your body. So there's two really simple agility drills. You can take those into, into a practice situation. It's not just speed and agility, it's also fielding. You can get creative and have guys throw the ball to you, roll it to you. Um, you can have the ball bounce at you. Uh, different ways where you actually have a glove on your hand and you need to field the ball instead of just attacking a stationary object. So take those drills, play with them, make them work for, how, for whatever situations you need. This is Coach Dan from Baseball Strength, signing off.